All best places to visit in Okoda Peak. Salak National Park, located in the western highlands of Honduras, Salak National Park is a must-visit destination in Okoda Peak. The park is known for its diverse range of flora and fauna, including the cloud forests and the magnificent Cerro Las Minas, the highest peak in Honduras. Visitors can enjoy hiking and camping in the park, exploring its numerous trails that lead to stunning viewpoints and waterfalls. The best time to visit is during the dry season from December to April when the weather is more favorable. The park is open daily from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m., and there is an entry fee of $5 per person. Parking space is available near the visitor center at no additional cost, and reservations are not required. Pets are not allowed in the park, but it is a family-friendly destination suitable for all ages. Gracias, this charming colonial town is a hidden gem in Okoda Peak. Known for its well-preserved architecture and historical sites, Gracias offers a glimpse into Honduras' colonial past. Visitors can explore the town's cobblestone streets, visit the 16th-century Iglesia de la Merced, and enjoy panoramic views from the Fortaleza de San Cristobal. Gracias is also the gateway to the nearby hot springs of La Campa, where visitors can relax in natural thermal pools. The town is a year-round destination, but the best time to visit is during the dry season from November to April. There are no entry fees or ticket costs for exploring the town and its attractions, and parking spaces can be found throughout the town. Reservations are not required, and pets are generally allowed in public areas. Gracias is a family-friendly destination with activities suitable for all ages. La Campa, located just a short drive from Gracias, La Campa is a small village famous for its natural hot springs. Visitors can soak in the warm mineral-rich waters while enjoying the beautiful surroundings. The hot springs are known for their therapeutic properties and are a popular destination for relaxation and rejuvenation. The best time to visit La Campa is during the dry season from November to April when the weather is more pleasant. There are no entry fees or ticket costs for accessing the hot springs, and parking is available nearby. Reservations are not required and pets are generally allowed in public areas. La Campa is a family-friendly destination, perfect for a day trip from Gracias. Santa Lucia Archaeological Site For history enthusiasts, the Santa Lucia Archaeological Site is a must-visit in Okoda Peak. This ancient Mayan city offers a fascinating glimpse into the region's pre-Columbian past. Visitors can explore the ruins of temples, pyramids, and residential areas, marveling at the intricate stone carvings and artifacts. The site is best visited during the dry season from November to April, as the rain can make the trails slippery. There is an entry fee of $3 per person, and the site is open daily from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. Parking space is available near the entrance, and reservations are not required. Pets are not allowed within the archaeological site, but it is a family-friendly destination suitable for all ages. Los Noobs Waterfall, nestled in the mountains of Okoda Peak, Los Noobs Waterfall is a natural wonder worth exploring. This picturesque waterfall cascades down a series of rock formations, creating a stunning spectacle. Visitors can hike through the lush forest to reach the waterfall, enjoying the scenic beauty along the way. The best time to visit is during the rainy season from May to October when the waterfall is at its fullest. 
There are no entry fees or ticket costs for visiting Lost Noob's waterfall, and parking space is available near the trailhead. Reservations are not required, and pets are generally allowed on the trails. It is a family-friendly destination, but caution should be. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.